Hey y'all, it's me, Michael Mitchell, back with another YouTube video. The topic of my video is Doja Cat has a bad attitude towards her fans. So no further ado, here I go. Let's do this. I know I'm a little late with this topic, but I gotta speak on it. Doja Cat lost like 300,000 subscribers on Instagram due to her bad attitude towards her fans after she said to her fans, get a job. And she says she doesn't love her fans as well. So she had lost like a lot of, a lot of followers on Instagram, like 300,000, 500,000 of followers on Instagram so due to her attitude on Instagram the way she came off the way she speak to her fans so my topic um my two cents is is this you can't you can't just Disrespect, you can't just disrespect the people who have supported you along the way. Because one thing about your fans, they made you, they made you who you are. And they can break you at any time if you get out of line. Now, let's look at some of the things that she be saying on Instagram, on Instagram, shall we? Okay, let's see. So, Instagram followers have unsus have un have stopped following Doja Cat on Instagram. So, Doja has lost more than three hundred thousand followers straight after sharing a string of controversial posts that call her that call her hardcore fans creepy like you can't be saying things like that calling your fans creepy that's disrespectful if you if you can't respect your fans then you don't then being a singer is not for you that's the bottom line. She told her fans to get a job. Well, if you're gonna tell your fans to get a job, you better be following your own. You better be following your own advice when, when, when your next concert will be empty seats. Nobody's not gonna come to your concert. So think about that. We think about that when you start disrespecting your fans. So. Doja Cat to me comes off as a disrespectful human being. She reminds me of Carrie Hils Carrie Hilson. Remember Carrie Hilson? She 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 had a song called Turn Me On with Lil Wayne. And she was disrespectful to her fans. And I believe that she had made a diss track towards Beyonce. Wish that wish that killed her career. So Carrie so Doja Cat reminds me of Carrie Hilson in a way. Cause I have I I watched a video on YouTube like back in 09 or or two thousand or 2010 on this it this this youtuber saying Carrie Hilson is a mean person so I don't know if that's true I gotta find that video somewhere but that's what I heard about Carrie Hilson and Doja Cat reminds me of Carrie Hilson let's see 
Oh boy. Doja Doja Cat has lost five hundred thousand Instagram Instagram followers in the past months due to her bad attitude. Okay, Doja alleged remarks spark sweeps of criticism online and resulting to several of her biggest supporters deleted their fan account on Twitter. So she had lost a lot of fans on Twitter as well due to her, due to her being disrespectful and saying mean things to her fans. So... When you say me things, this what this what happens to you. Doja reportedly went on to write, "My fans don't name themselves shit. If you call yourself a kitten or a fucking kittens, that means you need to get off your phone and get a job and help your parents." with the house the term kittens has come to be recognized as the collective name of her stardom and was actually coined by doja herself is a in a twitter poll a few years ago like i look at it like why would you call your fans kittens? That's a stupid. That's a. That's that is. No, no, no. That's not it. Why call your fans kittens? That's not that. That's not. That's not. That's not a nice thing to call your your true fans kittens. Like, I don't know if she have a cat or not, but your fans are not. Your fans are not your kittens. Come on now. Come on. Come on. Doja, you gotta do better than that. Now that was disrespectful when she said to her fans, get a job, get off your phone, and help your parents with the house. Oh boy. Now see that's one see that's what's gonna get you in trouble. When you say things like that, be prepared when you lose a lot of so be prepared when you're gonna lose a lot of followers on Insta Instagram. So Doja Cat is the Doja Cat, Doja Cat did this to herself. She so she so she had herself to blame. So you, you don't say things like that. Like I'm pretty sure her fans help I'm pretty sure her fans help their parents with the house. I mean, I'm pretty sure her fans have a job. Like, I don't know what type of world that Doja is living in. Like, we are living in a time where people are, people are gonna be on their phones a lot keeping up with social media. I don't know what type of world she thinks she's living in, but hey, she said it and she get what she deserved. Now she said this on Instagram. My life, my rules, my style, my attitude. Somebody said, I want to hear you say, do I do love you guys. Let me see. Uh, usually you say you love your fans. And Doja came back like, I don't, cause I don't though, cause I don't, I don't even know y'all. And somebody else said, 
and we don't know you, but we have supported you through thick and thin. Mind you, you'll be nothing without us. You'll be working at a grocery store making songs on a fucking garbage band, Miss High School Dropout. And Dosha came back like, Nobody forced you. I don't I don't know why you I don't know why you're talking to me like you're my mother, bitch. You sound like a crazy person. See this is why this was what makes this what makes Doja Cat a really mean person right here. Like take Taylor Swift, Taylor Swift, for example. Taylor Swift is one of the most high-paid singers of our time. Her shows are selling out like crazy. I don't think that Taylor Swift would be talking to her fans on Instagram like this. But why is Doja Cat is speaking to her fans like this, talking to talking down the talking down to her fans like they're nothing? If you can't say you love your fans, then you're heading for a downfall. No ifs, ands, buts about it. You are heading for a downfall. And I don't think Doja Cat is going to is going to survive in this isn't going to survive in this music where she keep if she keep up like this, man. Like for real. And and whoever this person is, whoever this person is. I don't know if it's is he a he or a she, but this person is right. Your fans have supported you through thick and thin. You wouldn't be nothing without your fans. Cause if you weren't this big if you wasn't a a big time singer, you'll be working at a grocery store making songs. Now I don't know if this is true or not that Doja Cat is a high school dropout. I don't know. But I don't know. I got I to gotta do some research and find out if that's true or not. But, man, I, I did not know that Doja Cat was this disrespectful. But, she is. But, hey, she lost a lot of, a lot of fans and a lot of, sub, and a lot of followers on Instagram due to her disrespectful ways. So, she's not going to survive. I, I can tell you that right now. A different user then appear to respond. And we don't know you. But we have supported you through thick and thin. Mind you, you'll be nothing without us. You'll be working at a grocery store making songs. On a fucking gar garbage garage band, Miss High School Dropout. Doja wrote back, "Nobody forced you. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't know why you are talking to me like you're my mother, bitch. You sound like a crazy person." Let me tell you something about this girl. This Doja Cat is not gonna make it. I don't see. I don't know. I don't know why this girl is talking to her fans like that. But I'm glad that she have lost a lot of followers because her followers don't deserve her disrespect. Like. If you can't treat your fans with respect, then you don't deserve to be a singer. You don't deserve to have a fan base who supported you. You don't deserve to have fans have fans if you can't say that you love them. Even though even though that you don't know them personally and your fans don't know you, but they have supported you, 
like your music. I don't know why. This this girl cannot even sing. She and she want and she, I heard she that she raps too. She probably can't rap either. So, oh my lord, this girl, this Doja Cat woman is so disrespectful. Like it's crazy. She reminds me of Carrie Hilson. Carrie Hilson came off as a mean person, mean to her fans, made a diss song up towards Beyonce. Now, in 2023, Doja Cat lost a lot of followers on Instagram. Good, she deserved that. Like, you don't speak to your fans like that. How dare you? Like, this girl... Doja Cat needs to check her attitude. This girl, Doja Cat is heading for a downfall. And that downfall will be her losing millions of fans on Instagram. And she deserved that. So, that's all I have to say about the situation. This your boy, Michael Mitchell. Like, comment, and subscribe. And Stay safe, be careful, and take care of yourself and each other, and let today be yours. Remember the motto, Team Positive.